what's going on I want to make a video of mind over matter <laughs> and the truth behind it well it can go both ways your mind can only take you so far and I mean there's countless examples of this you hear a lot of people say it's all in your mind you can do anything over your mind that is true to extent but if you kept doing that you'd burn out your body <laughs> just like yeah you could do a thousand push-ups <clears throat> run through a desert <laughs> and multiple other things you usually hear someone that's real tough a marine guy or someone on the tougher side maybe that works out a lot or something like this they always talk about mind of a matter just to catch you grab your attention it's pretty much all a bunch of bullshit I will admit there is some stability and some limit to it which can uphold but not that <laughs> of course your mind controls pretty much everything but you can't make of course anything's possible but for the most part if let's say you're starving yeah you can keep putting your hunger off and distracting yourself and keep telling yourself you're not hungry but ultimately what that what's that gonna do it's just gonna burn you out burn you out because ultimately you're hungry and you need to eat something in the physical world your mind can't really eat anything <laughs> So mind over matter, for the most part, it's just one big hoax. And like again, you usually get tough guys. Oh, I can push the limit. Yeah, your body, your body's completely different from what your mind can do. It totally is. Because some people's bodies can't even do a push-up. Some people's body can do 10. And some people can push their body all the way to do like a thousand. This traffic is just like where I have to go. So spaced out that the, how the cars are coming. Anyways, yeah, there's some people, let's just say, that can do one push up. And no matter how hard they try in the mind over matter, they're not gonna be able to do another push-up <laughs> physically they're not <laughs> it's impossible <laughs> no matter how hard they try I'm not saying it couldn't happen but for the most part it's not <laughs> you can kind of understand the logic that's coming from here now somebody who's a marine who has body a physical body who can destroy his body all day and keep going yeah he might be able to do 100 push-ups and ask him to do 100 more he probably could <laughs> But that's not saying he's doing more damage done than what is proposed. So the mind over matter thing is just a bunch of bullshit. And again, you always have to take something from the physical world no matter what it is. Whether it's rest or you need to consume energy. And it's just that it's plain and simple you know like yeah you can push yourself you can you can go days without eating but eventually your physical body will shut down so mind over matter there is a limit in in retrospect of to the physical body yeah like if there's a day you're feeling down and you don't want to do anything this is like the upside I guess of mind over matter and if there's a day you're feeling down or you don't want to do something or you're feeling really exhausted yeah you can push yourself to do something but ultimately your your mind can go on way longer than the physical body can it can push itself and do way more and it takes probably almost more energy to think and use your mind more than anything else <laughs> I'm not I'm just basing that off experience <laughs> and yeah like you can be drastically tired and push yourself and push yourself but 
and being like, oh yeah, I'm not strong enough, I keep going. And in some cases, yeah, it will be cool to do, to know you can do that and to know there isn't barriers necessarily in the proof to yourself or do something that's been a motivating in a way, kind of inspirational. But to do it all the time, you would just burn out your body. <laughs> And your body is going to give you symptoms and signals that it needs to rest. <laughs> of course, yeah, you can push it. Just like this hot ass day I'm walking on. Though I'm not really exhausted necessarily or anything like that or even tired. Even though I am sweating like crazy. It's uh, not that crazy, I guess. But yeah. <laughs> If my body says, hey, it wants to rest, I have two options. I can go freaking and just keep pushing and say, fuck it. And eventually it's just going to get more tired and more tired. It's not like it's going to go past that. I'm going to spring and oh, I'm not going to be tired anymore. It's impossible. That's bullshit. <laughs> Your body wanted the rest. <laughs> yeah, you can push beyond it and you might feel like reluctant or get distracted or something. But ultimately, you're still tired. Every time that I push my time, same thing. Well, my body or whatever pushed it past the tiredness you're gonna make up for it one way or another <laughs> and eventually if you would just listen to your body signal and be in tune with it and then you would rest when you'd want to rest or do whatever the body says uh, thanks for tuning in that's all I have to say about this video just be aware about the knowledge because knowledge is very little it's about experience and how you feel so a lot of people say bullshit all the time almost 99% of people are talking out their ass Thanks for tuning in. Subscribe. Give me a like. Give me a dislike. Let me know how you feel in the experience box below. Check out some of my other videos. Thanks for tuning in.